Oh my god, was that not electrifying? Freestyle football, all you need is a ball. You're loving the show, right? Now let me take you to the next segment that is what? Up close. And up close today, we have one of the top notch footballers Ghana has ever produced. Oh my god, he has played in the United States of America, Scotland, Israel, and currently he's a coach in Ghana. Oh, you know what? You want to see? Join me, Skyball TV. Hello, people. My name is Kale Boss, the only boss with one S. Bossu Bakope. This is Skyball TV. Bam, in it. My name is Lai Kingston, former Black Stars player. I'm married. I have four children, three boys with a girl. Um, today I'm going to talk about my career and what I'm doing now. First of all, I'd like to tell you that I was born and bred in Jamestown. I grew up on the streets of Jamestown, Accra, to be precise. Uh, I started football with a coast team called Me and You Babies. Um, I, st I played there for a while. Played in the under 14s and then uh, graduated to the under 17s until one of the best teams at that time, called Kowlin Babies, came to sign me on. Uh, that time I was one of the best players in the team and then in the league as well. Uh, alongside players like Dorina Trump, Steven Apia, Aulekwe Jr., Peter Forukwe, Edmund Copson, and many more. Most of them made it to the top as well as Dan Kwe, Aziz Ansan. Uh, it, it's that year we managed to be, on, be unbeaten, win all the games, and then qualify to the regionals, which uh, our team, Kowling Babies, represent Greater Accra. And the tournament was played in Kumasi. Uh, I had a very good tournament. That was when I, had, I was spotted to represent Ghana in the under-15 national team. Uh, I stayed there for a while, for one or two years, and then uh, I signed for Accra Great Olympics in the top, top flight football in the country, which is the Premier League. I stayed in the Olympics for, for some time, and then I graduated from the national team under-15 to the under-17s. Under-17, I played in the African Cup and then the World Cup as well. African Cup, we were third place and then in the World Cup, we were runners up to Brazil in 1997. From there, I joined, which I stayed there for a while and then in the 20s. And at 20, I played in the uh, African Cup, which Ghana won. And then from there, I graduated to the Olympic team, which is Meteos, national under 23. And then to uh, Israel. First of all, I, w I moved to Saudi Arabia for a loan spell for six months. After the loan, uh, and then uh, moved to Israel for two years contract. I played one year in Israel and then uh, uh, moved to Russia. Stayed there for three and a half years. And then from Russia to Scotland. Stayed in Scotland for four years. Uh, after Scotland, uh, I moved to Holland, played in Holland for six months, and then uh, back to Arts of Folk, you know. And then uh, during that period, I was still playing for the senior national team, which is the Black Stars. I was part of the players that qualified the nation to the first World Cup, 2006 World Cup in Germany. I played almost all the games, all the qualifying games. I was regular in the team too. With that year, we have fantastic players. Especially our midfield, everyone is saying we are one of the best midfield uh, in Africa and uh, if not the world. Uh, myself, Asian, Steven Apia and Sule Muntari. We had a great midfield that time, which I, I was lucky, fortunate enough to, 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 to have set players around me. I think those days the players around me bring the best out of me. Uh, that is the twilight of my career, you know. After that, uh, uh, I hung my boots not long ago 
last year in uh, June. Then I started uh, going into coaching, which is going well at the moment. At the moment, I'm coaching as well, at the moment. It's going very well. Well, I have uh, my personal academy that I am managing, and then uh, uh, I have a two years contract with uh, an international international school called Al Irian in uh, East Legon. Uh, I'm developing their school team. I've stayed with them for I have two years contract, but at the moment I've spent almost two months with them, and I can see improvement. The players have improved a lot. So uh, that is it. I'm looking forward to uh, in my coaching career. One day I will be, be coaching one of the national teams in the country, and then my aim is to win trophies. Win trophies, get uh, 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 to coach uh, one of the Premier League clubs in the country. That's that's what what I'm working towards at the moment. Freestyle football is a game that uh, is very good for every footballer. You know, because in, in in the real football you need to have skills to go behind your opponent and all that. So I think freestyle football is, is, is very, very important. And uh, most of the people in the country and all over the world enjoy watching or participating in, in it. I've been one of the judges in Ghana uh, about three occasions. I've been judged and I've judged th three tournaments. Uh, I was judging one time with uh, one of the best freestylers uh, in, the, in the name of Sian from France. Uh, he did one or two tricks and that uh, blew me away, you know, and all the fans around uh, the auditorium at that time. So uh, it's something that is close to my heart. Uh, uh, as a football player, you need that. And then uh, uh, I encourage and hedge every person to, 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 to encourage his, his colleague, his, his, his children, to, 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 to get used to freestyle football because I believe it's a key to, 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 to the world. It's interesting and it brings the best out of you, you know, because you have to uh, 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 in, uh, improvise or be creative, bring your own style on, you know, because there are techniques or skills in the world that individual brings it out. So why not try to uh, uh, exhibit something that you also uh, created so that tomorrow someone will mention your name that it's you who, who bring that thing. So I urge everyone to, to, to be part of this uh, family and I think it's the best. Hello viewers, my name is Laya Kingston, former Black Stars player. Keep watching Skyball TV.